Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Nort. I hope you guys are having an absolutely awesome day. And what we are going to do today is a follow-up to an episode we did a couple of weeks ago. I think it was like two or three weeks ago. And this is to see what happens if we arrest Michael's family in GTA 5. It sounds so strange. How on earth are we able to do this? Well, I do actually have this police mod enabled. So whenever we go to one of these uh, logos or star signs around the map, these are police stations, which means we can then register as a police officer officer and we can go around arresting whoever we want to in GTA 5. And an idea I came up with a while ago was seeing what would happen if we arrested a protagonist. So we went after Michael and Trevor and Michael tried to run. Trevor wasn't happy either as well. They were both kind of resisting being arrested. But since doing that episode, loads of you guys have been asking me to arrest certain things in GTA. So for example, there's uh, a few other locations you want me to go to. But the idea which got my eye the most is arresting Michael's family in front of Michael. So this will be really interesting because I know Michael loves his family. So if we try and go near his family and arrest them, then I'm not too sure what Michael will do, but I'm sure he won't be happy. So either way, guys, this is going to be really interesting. I hope you do enjoy this episode. As always, if you do, be sure to smash that thumbs up button. Uh, but is anyone home? Let's take a look. Is anyone home at all? Oh, there we go. There's Amanda, there's Jimmy, there's Tracy. Everyone is around the table. How's it going, guys? They do not seem happy to see me whatsoever. Okay, so I'm going to go over to Franklin anyway. And we're going to arrest Michael's family. Oh my days. So this is what's going to happen. I'm going to walk inside the station. And I'm not too sure where we go actually. There's a certain place we have to be in order to register as an actual officer. Is it downstairs? I think it might be downstairs. How's it going? There's this desk. Can we register here? I have no idea. We have to register somewhere around here though. Oh, it's in here. Oh yes, of course it is. There we go. We're going to go on duty. We have to go to the locker room. Of course we do. I, I thought of every single location but the locker room. So now I'm inside here. We can dress up as an officer and we can become an officer and go on duty, essentially. I'm just going to straight up go for the LSPD. We can also be all of these people as well, depending on wherever we are in the map. Uh, we can be Noose as well. Like, we can be so many awesome characters here. But for today, we're going to be the LSPD. I want to get myself a hat. Yeah, there we go. Hat and shades. There we go. So we can select this. This will now be our outfit. And I'm not too sure where my vehicle is. You can select vehicle at the garage marked by a car. Okay. Let's just go for the normal cruiser. Although, yeah, we'll go... Wait, no, I'm not sure. We'll go for this one, the Interceptor. This one looks good. And now we can patrol Los Santos and arrest whoever we want to. We'll also get these missions as well, which will ask us to uh, to basically follow up on certain things happening around Los Santos. There's two people here. I'm just going to show you guys what happens if we do arrest someone. So, yep, I'll just park up here. <laughs> Hey, how's it going? You having a good evening? Yep, I'm sure you are. Okay, so this is what's going to happen. I'm going to just quickly arrest this person. And we're going to get them onto the ground. Go on, get on the ground. Get on the ground, dude. Get on the ground. Come on. Come on, get on the ground. Don't make me ask you twice. Get on the ground. All right, it looks like he's calming down a bit. There we go. He's getting on the ground now. Good. Good stuff. And now we're going to arrest the suspect. And as you can see, just by doing this, we've already got uh, a random pursuit happening just around the corner. Now we're going to take them over to the jail. And I believe to go to the jail, I could probably go this way, actually. I'll take him in this way. Why not? We'll take him in this way, guys. So I'm going to get the guy out of the car. And I'm just going to grab this guy because he's refusing to get out of the vehicle. Come on, buddy. <laughs> Come on, get in, get in. Everything is pretty much spot on with how the police department works in GTA. And you can play a role in that with this mod. So I'm going to walk into the cell and what will happen is he will follow me in there. And he won't leave the cell from then on. He, he's in that cell. He's stuck there now, essentially. There we go. The door's closed. And now we can go off and pursue some missions, which we've been getting in the corner of our screen. I really want to go to the dispatch notices, but we don't have time, guys. We don't have time. But if you want to see what happens when we do go to those blue zones, which come up on the map every now and then, make sure you guys go and follow my streams. I will leave a link to it in the description below. I live stream on a daily basis. And sometimes I do GTA 5 police mods. And I spend hours and hours just using this mod. And it's so much fun. So so if you want to see that, guys, make sure you click the link in the description below so you can stay updated on when I'm next live streaming. Anyway, it's time to go over to Michael's house. He better be ready. He better be ready. Last time I saw him, he was inside his house, though, and it is still the middle of the night, so I don't think he would have gone anywhere else. Anyway, I'm going to put the sirens on. It's getting real, guys. It is getting real. Oh, my days. What do you think Michael's going to do as well? If we arrest Amanda, for example, do you think Michael will kick off? Do you think he will stop us from doing that? Nope, he won't let us through the gate. Classic Michael. Classic Michael. Michael there, guys. I'll just climb over the gate myself. Amanda's not here. No one is here. Oh, my days. It's five in the morning. Where is everyone? Like, what do you do 
For real? What do these guys even do? All right, I'll come back here again anyway, and hopefully they'll be here again. Everyone out the way, quickly. This is an emergency. Everyone out the way. My old police car is still there. We'll have two there now. Jimmy, you better still be here, dude. You better still be here, man. What are we going to take him in for? Um... I'm not too sure. Either way, I want to see what Michael does. So what I've done is this, guys. I went back into Michael's house to find his family and get them to spawn in. And then I saved them into the entity base. So we have Tracy and Jimmy and Maid. This means that they can't actually despawn, but they're still the original entity. Uh, as you can see, if we walk into this room, I believe Michael is in there and Tracy will be in there as well. Oh, okay, Tracy is flying. But as you can see, Tracy is here as well, which means we can then arrest Tracy in front of Michael, essentially. And there's still the original NPC. We've basically just kept them in the entity base, so they can't despawn. We've basically saved them, if that makes sense. And I believe Jimmy was down here when I last saw him. Yep, he's still here. He's typing through a chair onto a table. Whoa, oh my days, what? What the heck? What is the- Okay, the maid does not care. She does not care. Oh my days. Uh, Michael, you need to sort this out, dude. <laughs> what the- Piece of What? She doesn't care. She actually doesn't- I'm gonna- I'll arrest you. I will straight up- I will arrest you, maid. What, what on earth is- she... Jeez. Okay, I might have to arrest her. Like, she is going crazy on me. <laughs> what? I'm, I'm taking her in front of Michael. Michael, you need to sort your maid out. Is this why you hired your maid? Because she will not let any intruder come in? Jeez. Michael, look at this. Do you, are you not going to do anything? Fine, you give me no choice. Maid, get on the floor. There we go. Jeez. Oh my days. <laughs> She's crazy. Stay there. I'm not here to arrest you, but you are crazy. All right, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to arrest Tracy and see what Michael does. Are you ready for this, Michael? Get on the floor, Tracy. Get on the floor. All right, I'm going to arrest you now. On, on the chair. Michael isn't doing anything, though. He's not doing anything at all. Michael, look, I've just arrested your daughter. Do you care? Nope, he doesn't seem to care at all. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's not doing anything. We've just arrested Michael's daughter. Are you kidding me? Get out of the vehicle. <laughs> Great. All right, time to get back over to Michael's house and arrest Jimmy now. And then we'll find out what happens if we arrest him. Like, will Michael do anything? He didn't do anything for Tracy. So I'm not too sure if he will do anything for Jimmy. I just hope he does something. Just anything. Come on, Michael. LSPD! Don't make me shoot ya! There we go. Okay, we're arresting Jimmy. <laughs> He's lying on the table. <laughs> I need to bring him in front of Michael to see if he does anything. You're doing nothing? For real? <laughs> What on earth is going on? Michael is just looking at him like disappointed or something. He looks so disappointed. All right, Jimmy, you're coming with me, dude. You're coming with me. So there you guys go. Michael does not care about his children whatsoever. <laughs> we still need to do this for Amanda, though. And I wonder if he will do anything for Amanda. Surely he has to do something. How was the ride? Good? Great. All right, get out of the vehicle. I'm going to need you to get out. Get out of the car. Get out of the car, Jimmy. <laughs> Follow me. Help me. You idiot. <laughs> Oh gosh, this officer, he's so mean. He's so mean. Oh gosh, come on, Jimmy, get inside, get inside. Yeah, Jimmy does not look happy at all. Arms folded. He's probably expecting Michael to get him out or something. I remember in campaign, there's that one mission where Michael will stop Amanda from getting arrested. She phones him up saying I'm in a police car or something and Michael will stop that from happening. So if we then arrest Amanda, what will Michael do? Because from what we've seen in the past, he did do something, which means he should do something again. So let's find out. Oh, there they are. There's Michael and there's Amanda. No one else is here. It's just Amanda and Michael. Oh, Michael told me to holster it. So he wants me to put this away. What are you going to do, Michael? What are you going to do? Eh? Yeah, I don't care. We're arresting Amanda. Put Michael, what? He, he's shouting at me. He's not happy. Dork. <laughs> my, my officer, this guy. How's it going, Amanda? Stupid. Jeez, come on. Calm down. We're just working oh, to see what... Oh, I got one too. Oh, okay. Michael. Michael is starting to shout at me. Let's see what happens if we just arrest her. I'm sorry, Michael. Okay, time to arrest Amanda. Let's do it. LSPD, hold it! Michael's not doing anything. He's not doing anything. Hey, 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 come back here. Come back here, Amanda. Come back here. Oh, stop it. She was trying to run away. Michael, are you seriously not doing anything? Are you seriously not doing anything? He's not doing anything. He's not even, like, talking to me. 
Yeah, he's not doing anything at all. Okay, Amanda. You're getting arrested then. Oh, okay. <laughs> Michael's starting to move again. He's pacing up and down. He does not look happy. This is getting kind of strange. He doesn't look happy at all. Come on, Amanda. Follow me. Oh, Michael does not look happy. He doesn't look happy. He's starting to pace. What is he doing? Hello. <laughs> hey, dude. <laughs> what? This is so strange. Where are you going, Michael? It's like he's looking for something. Where did Amanda go? There she is. It feels like he's trying to do something. He's in Jimmy's room. He's just realized like everyone's been arrested except for him now. So it feels like the only person who actually cared was the maid. It, it feels like that is the case. And maybe Michael hired her for that exact reason. And I was not expecting the maid to go crazy on us like that. He was doing something though. Like he was going up and down the stairs. He was acting a little bit strange. I'm not too sure what he was doing, but it was definitely strange indeed. There we go. There's Jimmy. There's Tracy. <laughs> We've got the entire of Michael's family in here. What the actual? Are you kidding me? So let's do this with Franklin, guys, and see what he does, because I have no idea. He might run away. Michael tried to, and Trevor wasn't too happy, so I'm sure Franklin will do something. I honestly think Chop is going to do something. We'll use the cruiser this time, the classic vehicle. Oh, gosh. All right, let's get out of the vehicle. Franklin, I think you're inside here anyway. I wonder if Chop's down here. Let's take a look. Oh, wait, can we... <laughs> You can see Franklin right through the glass. Oh my days. How's it going, Franklin? You doing good? No, Chop isn't here. Damn it. Damn it. Maybe he'll spawn in if we go and arrest Franklin. How are we going to get in here, though? I think there is a gap in the glass around the kitchen side. I believe so. Yes, I can see it. It's right there. Oh, Franklin. I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry we're doing this, but it needs to be done, man. There we go. We're arresting him. He's getting on the floor. He's not resisting. He's not resisting at all. Oh my days. So it looks like the only protagonist to ever resist this is Michael. He's the only protagonist whatsoever. And there we go. That's every single one of them arrested. We have the entire of Michael's family. We also have Franklin in there as well. I'm not too sure what happened to the other guy who was in here. Maybe he got released or something. I have no idea. But either way, there's Michael's family and Franklin arrested as well. So now you guys know exactly what happens if you arrest Michael's family. He does go a little bit crazy if you arrest Amanda. But if you arrest Jimmy or Tracy, he won't do anything at all. And are you okay, Amanda? Do you want some water? She does not look okay. And Franklin's just looking at a wall as well. So I'm not too sure what he's doing. But either way, guys, now you know exactly what happens. Of course, if you did enjoy this episode, be sure to smash that thumbs up button. And I recommend you press that subscribe button just below this video so you don't miss out on awesome stuff like this on a daily basis and if you want to see me do anything else in gta 5 just comment your idea in the comments below and you never know guys your idea might make it into another video but guys thank you so much for watching my name is Nort, and until next time stay absolutely awesome i'll see you guys in the next video